got a codex entry for it. Hell yeah. Oh, what the... Alright, let's go bait out this thing. Bait in the crate. Mm. Oh, snap. Security chest before somebody else gets it. I don't think that's an upgrade. Nope. For sure, none of this that I've gotten recently is an upgrade. And I need to sell. Wow. Didn't realize I had so much junk. Can't wait to get a companion so I can just tell them to go sell all my junk. Yeah, and I would jump shit from Comcast if that was actually an option. I wish I could do um, Verizon FIOS, but um, not going, not gonna happen. Somebody asked what spec I'm going. I'm going whichever the healing spec is. I don't know what it is for uh, Sith sorcerers. For Sage, it was Seer, I think. So whatever the equivalent for Sork is. And I've already played a uh, Sorcerer, or I'm sorry, a Sage to to like 20. So I'm used to the abilities because they're the same. Just different graphics and different names. Research supply crate. These supplies were being used by the Acolytes for searching the tomb of Mark Marka Ragnos. The Acolytes were driven mad, however, and these supplies needed to be returned to Sergeant Garrus. Take the supplies to Sergeant Garrus. Alright. Let me go ahead and sell this junk that I have. Corruption, yes, corruption. That is what I'm going for. It should not be difficult to level. Uh, granted, I only, again, I only got to level 20. But uh, it was very easy to level. Uh, as a healer. In beta. Because your... Um, your companion... Your first companion is a tank. And can tank pretty well. As a matter of fact, I was, um, if you watch my Let's Play It All, <coughs> hint, hint, um, I actually soloed a lot of stuff that no other classes that couldn't heal probably could have ever soloed. Just because I was a healer class. I'm running out of patience. Have you finally acquired the mutant Tukata brain, or should I send someone Oops. else? Wait a minute. Give me more time. 
So wait, mm. giving him the brain is dark side. So wait, I want to say give me more time. Lord. You'll have it soon. Don't bother me again until you have my brain. So wait, don't tell me giving her the brain is light side? Have you recovered the mutant Tukata brain yet? I'm eager to conclude the business we discussed. Wait, what? So giving her the brain is light side? How in the hell does that work? That makes no sense. Unless, I mean, I guess he's right in that... I guess what they're saying is he's actually correct in that the brains are... Or that his research is correct and it's actually leading him... His research leading him towards true dark sidedness, whatever. But the whole thing... The whole plan is dark side eat up with dark side. Sorry. I'm still hunting the mutant Takata. The beast is twice the size of a normal Takata. We're obviously not looking hard enough. I don't see how it hurts the the dark side people though because if his research was bad, it wouldn't hurt the the dark side, right? If it was faulty research, then it's not really hurting them. So his research must not be bad. So she's wrong, and his research actually is valid. I'm running out of patience. Have you finally acquired the mutant Tukata brain, or should I send someone else? Here's the brain. I got what you wanted. <sighs> ha! Wonderful. Let me see it. Don't forget who helped you. Remember those who aided your research, my lord. When I bestow my wisdom to the entire Empire, you will share some minuscule fraction of my glory. You've done an impressive job, young alien. I have no qualms about rewarding your effort. Oh, <laughs> yes! Melora is a traitor. Melora asked me to sabotage your experiment. Is that so? Melora, if you can't show my work the appreciation it deserves, there's no place for you as my apprentice. Wait, Master. It's a lie. I haven't betrayed you. I know the truth when I hear it, Melora. I'm releasing you from my service. Eventually. <laughs> Master, please. Stop. No. <laughs> my dear, the pain for you is only beginning. Take your reward and leave. Melora and I have much to discuss. Sounds like you need some help. I appreciate your kind offer, but I prefer to handle this myself. Farewell. <laughs> hey, I wonder if she's like totally cool with me now. We're cool, right? I mean, that thing. You're not mad about that. Congratulations. You've helped a delusional maniac remain in power. I hope you're pleased with yourself. I am, actually. Thank you. <laughs> uh. Give in to the dark side. Wait, where's the... Oh, yeah. Up here. Yeah, that was a pretty cool mission. It's still odd that that was a light side choice. I could see it being a neutral choice. But being light side is very bizarre. Because your reasoning is not Our light side. Three datacrons on this planet, huh? Hmm. Yeah, in the beta, it actually told you. Like, if you clicked on the planet, it would tell you how many datacrons were on that planet. And I'm not seeing that now. Which is kind of a 
kind of a bummer. It just says codex entries found. Which I'm totally going to try to get every codex for every planet now. Do I have a title? Nope. No titles yet. Oh, wait, there's a quest out here. Turn in out here, rather. I think we can uh, turn off vendors. Yes, can I help you with something? Hold on. Are those the research supplies we were after? I'd given up on them days ago. You've no idea how much I appreciate this. Some of these chemicals take months to manufacture. Not much use to you, but vital to us. Thank you. You're welcome to use some of our equipment as compensation. I'll make sure to mention you to the commander. We have better belt. Sell my old one. <laughs> so telling him the truth is dark side. Tell me how that makes sense. But really, if you do... When I was doing the Sage quests, man, the Jedi really... Man, those guys are jerks too. For real. The Jedis are serious a-holes. This whole nonsense about them being good, righteous defenders and goody two shoes, man, that's a bunch of PR crap. You better not be wasting my time, slave. You better have the holocron. Hmm. A fake. Or stolen from the library, probably. I'll deal with you later. Now, I believe it's time for another demonstration. Gur, step forward. Yes, uh, Overseer. Like from Invader... Fong. Invader Kill Zim? Him. With pleasure, Overseer. You returned your books late to the library. <laughs> Let Gur be an example to you. Fon destroyed him easily, like he will destroy all of you. Are there any other objections? You are only giving us power, Harkon. And your comments are only hastening your death, slave. Now the rest of you know the next trial. Go. You, slave, stay here. Now, slave, you think yourself pretty clever getting that holocron, don't you? Stop with your taunts and give me my next trial. If you wish to prolong your life, you will not make demands of me again, slave. Now for your trial. The last, darkest secrets of Tulak Horde are buried in his tomb. Lord Zash wants this text. But the final resting place of the dead lord is not easily trespassed. You will not be the first to die there. I would choose an option right now, but the cat is totally in the way of all three of them. Thank you. I will return, and with the text. Do not come back here until you've gotten the text from Tulak Horde's tomb. Out of my sight, slave! So, I really do have to question the intelligence of the Sith. Oh, I got my dress finally. Thank God. Hmm. It looks good, but it makes my uh makes it looks like I have no hips. I don't have any childbearing hips, that's a shame. Oh 
I want to put my hood up. Ooh, two quests. So, yet another acolyte stands in the shadow of our academy. You must consider yourself privileged. That's, Tell a, me, Alien, that's a word you could use. Have you seen much of our civilization so far? Have you been awed by this world's power and glory? Indeed, I have. Korriban is most inspiring, my lord. You find it so? Then you should understand something. Korriban was wrought by the true-blooded Sith millennia ago. Our ancestors, a crimson race of conquerors, raised the statues around us. Over the eons, however, our people mingled with slaves. Now the red markings of true Sith are rare, and the purity of this planet is in question. You're mingling with a former slave right now. Is that so? This is a sad day, but you may yet be useful. True purity and strength are carried in the blood. I worry that our blood is being diluted over generations. In the Emperor's name, I have come to learn whether the Academy's overseers are Sith or not. You will be my instrument. Who are you to judge whether Sith are pure or inferior? As an agent of the Emperor and the Dark Council, I will report to them, and if necessary, seek ways to restore hereditary supremacy. I possess an ancient device, a holocron, that can read and record bloodlines. It will pulse with life near the Overseers. Allow the holocron to fulfill its purpose. Stand near the Overseers as it attunes to their blood purity. Then return here, and I will learn the truth. Interesting. I have need of you, young one. Whatever errand your master sent you on can wait until we are through. My master can rot for all I care. Then it's time you had some direction. I am Inquisitor Eurinth, and I represent the intelligence operations of the Sith. We are currently holding an important Jedi prisoner. A spy who attempted to reach this academy. We have plans for him. Upon capture, we found the Jedi's mind simple to manipulate. We fed him false memories through a combination of drugs and sorcery. Soon he will return to his Jedi commanders and report the lies we fed him. He will know nothing of what we've done. All that remains is to stage his escape. Look no further. I am your Sith. Good. I'm pleased that you appreciate our project. Thumbs up. You are young enough, new enough, to be a plausible traitor. You will go to the Jedi, talk to him, do as he asks, earn his trust. When that is done, set him free. Do whatever is necessary to get him out of prison. We will ensure that he reaches his ship and returns safely to his Jedi friends. Consider it done. You will find the Jedi Quarry and Dorgis in the jail cells. He is still confused and should not be overly difficult to convince. Alright. Let's go to the jails and talk to this Jedi. This Jedi scum. I'm assuming the light gear and the, the dark gear, by the way, are the same. It's just different. Like, you just. It's probably the same stats. There is no emotion. There is peace. There is no ignorance. There is knowledge. The Jedi Code will guide me. I take it you're the Jedi who was captured. I'm Corian Dorgis. I'm a Jedi. Even here. Even on Korriban. Why do you care? Why are you here? No one should have to suffer like that. You mean that? A Sith with a conscience? You're here to help me. Why am I talking in circles? What's wrong with me? You need to calm down. You're right. I apologize. There's no passion. There's serenity. There's no chaos. There's harmony. The Jedi Code will guide me. I can focus. 
If you want to help me escape, I'll need my belongings, my lightsaber, my comlink. Before I was captured, the Sith chased me into the tomb of Tulak Horde. I hid my belongings inside an urn to light my load. That is where you'll need to go. All right, let's go ahead and uh, train before we leave. And if this place is like the Jedi Temple, which I'm sure that it is, our trainer will be upstairs. We have a quest upstairs too. Not sure which quest that is. What quest do I have up here? Oh right, the scanning of the lords. I'm gonna try to actually do this quest because I might get another level before I train. I am definitely not going light side with this character. Absolutely not. I am going dark side. The only side. Hey man, what's up? I'm just just gonna stand here. Oh, don't no don't don't mind me. I'm cool, bro. We're cool. Oh oh no no. Oops no. I just uh just playing my Rubik's cube. No, I got him leaving now. See you later, buddy. I might as well train while I'm up here. There's a holocron in inside of here. A holocron or a datacron? Ah, a lore object. There's a holocron upstairs across the upper level of the library. Alright, I'll check that out. Somebody was mentioning that in the stream. Oops, that's not what I meant. One level over. I want to go train. Uh, that holocron just gave me uh, a, dead, a holocron entry. At last. A worthy disciple. Electrocute. Electrocute's the target, dealing 36 to 50 damage and stunning it for 4 seconds. Be gone. I'm only being gone because I want to, not because you told me to. Oh, there's another lore object. Luckily, they glow very brightly, so it's kind of obvious. Admission to the Sith Academy. They also give you XP, not much, but new codex entry. Yeah, these don't give you stats or anything, but... I'm assuming you might get a title, like if you get all the codex entries for a planet, maybe. Or maybe all the codex entries in the game, period. I don't know. Alright, that's all the... Oh. That's the one I just got, right? Yeah, alright. interest in here. Hi guys, am I interrupting? Nope. Alright. The the things that give you stats are data crons. Data crons are the ones that give you stats. see 
anything in here. Wow. Their lockers look like, uh, look like crypts. Or, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Caskets. Those are mission areas. Now this guy right here, that is the first companion you get as a inquisitor. Check in here real fast. This should be this, the next, the last area that I'm going to head out. Oh, there's another one. Oop, almost fell off. Oh, damn it. That is the one I got for. Oh, well. All right, we're heading out. We're heading out. All right, let's go downstairs. For the purity quest. I just can't take male Twi'lek in, like, seriously in any class role. Sorry, I just can't do it. All right, male purity. Male purity, uh, purity quest, wow. Dark Lords of Rage. Wow, that's a serious business quest name, if I've ever heard one. Why was that not showing on the map? That's bizarre. Usually, uh, usually quests will show up on the map. Oh, maybe because... Hmm. I don't know. Come here, child. Do you intend to explore the Academy? To know the world that gave birth to the Sith, you should linger here a while. I am Overseer Raggate, a keeper of the old ways. I sense you have potential, and I can help you if you like. Everyone in the Academy seems to sense my potential. But you have not yet come into your own. You have power and strength in the Force, but you must be tested beyond the trials your masters have set for you. I administer the rite of blood and bone, a ritual performed beyond this doorway. It is a rite acolytes have participated in for 10,000 years. I'm sure you were young and pretty back then. Yes, I am shriveled. I am infirm. Yet, I survive. More than most Sith can say. Learn from my example. In the chambers past the gateway, there is a colony of Shyrax. My leather-winged, razor-talent children and their brood. They guard a mountain of skulls. An altar to the Academy's failures. You must reach the bones before proceeding. You promised a rite of blood and bone. Where's the blood? Clever, cruel child. I have your answer. You must claim a skull from the mountain and return to the antechamber. Soak the skull in the blood pool and come to me. Once bone has turned red, I will look and see your nature written in crimson stains. And possibly a glimpse of your future. I'll admit that does sound intriguing. To complete the right is to accept one's death. To steal one's own mortality and drown it in the fluid of life. That is the symbolic purpose. But it is also a trial of power. As are all Sith trials, a trial to test strength and to grant it. I will await you here. If you die, I will forget you. Yeah, I have a feeling she forgets lots of things. Alright, let's do this. this. Sounds like an interesting little quest. Excuse me, I had to sneeze. This sounds like an interesting quest. Oh, you didn't really go into that that area, did you? Oh man, yeah, no, no. That's actually just uh, just the headmaster's grandmother. She doesn't. Uh, she's not actually a Sith or anything. Uh, things are actually one 
level higher than me. Not that that's a problem. 